Welcome to your AFN Korea 2-Minute Report. I'm Katu Surprise with Jun Sang Yoon. Little space, waiting in line, and not enough equipment can make it hard to be motivated with a workout routine. But life at K-16 just got a little easier. Specialist Keith Burkhardt hit their new gym where staying in shape comes with a state-of-the-art facilities. Two, three, four. The ribbon was cut along with the cake. But even with a little indulgence, it will now be more convenient at K-16 to burn those extra calories. The ribbon cutting ceremony was for the grand reopening of the K-16 Air Base Fitness Center. The fitness center saw a massive upgrade from the ground up, with everything from the refinished floors in the racquetball court and gymnasium to the heating and cooling system. Even a new fire alarm system and $150,000 spent on 51 pieces of brand new workout equipment from new treadmills to knotless machines. The gym tripled in size with a 2,000 square foot addition to fit the new equipment and create room for everyone. That's the biggest benefit right now, having most space to work out. Input from the community was another benefit for those responsible for the renovation, and the soldiers' requests did not go unheard. This is going to be a, a great effort for the soldiers and family members here at K-16. The effort received acknowledgement, and shortly after the reopening, the community already showed a positive response. Even when I was here when it was open before, I didn't see half the amount of people coming here as I do now. So a new gym means a lot more people are going to get in shape. Hopefully an improved fitness environment at K-16 will motivate the community to work out. And the gym is now organizing fitness classes to get everyone involved. Specialist Keith Burkhart, Youngsun, Korea. The K-16 Air Base Fitness Center spent over $2 million in renovations, and even more equipment is still to come. That was your two-minute report. I'm Katu Surprayevich, Jun Sang-in.